New health benefits are on the way for Marines and their families who were exposed to toxic water at Camp Lejeune with the signing of the Honoring America's Veterans and Caring for Camp Lejeune Families Act. This signature marked a major milestone in Jerry Insminger's quest for the truth. This bill uh, ends a decade-long struggle uh, for those who served at Camp Lejeune. Insminger has made it his mission to prove there was toxic water at the base after losing his nine-year-old daughter to leukemia, which he ties directly to the contamination. Sadly, you know, this act alone will not bring back those who've lost, uh, including uh, Janie Ensminger, but uh, it will honor their memory by making a real difference uh, for those who are still suffering. The bill will provide health benefits to Marines and their families who were exposed to the water at Camp Lejeune between 1957 and 1987. It's a start, and we got to start somewhere. And for Ensminger, the passing of this new law is a bittersweet victory. He says on one hand, all of his and everyone else's hard work has finally paid off. But on the other hand, he says this bill is a confirmation that there was, in fact, toxic water on base that was harming these Marines, something he's been trying to prove all along. We were wronged. And, uh, uh, the, and I don't care what the Department of the Navy and Marine Corps say, uh, they harmed us. And, and what's unfortunate was they knowingly harmed us. He says there are things about the new law he still doesn't like, and he's not giving up the fight yet. It means the beginning of some closure, some justice, uh, but it is, uh, it's, it's not the end by any means. Ensminger says now he wants accountability from those who are responsible. Our slogan and our motto, our motto is Semper Fidelis, which is Latin for always faithful. Our slogan is we take care of our own. That motto and slogan are very much alive and well down at the unit and operating level. However, I am extremely disappointed with the leadership, the highest levels of leadership in the United States Marine Corps and Department of Navy. And most of all, he just wants the truth. We are still having a very, very difficult time getting the truth out of the Department of Navy and the United States Marine Corps. Their misconduct is inexcusable. While Ensminger says this new law is a major step in the right direction, he says he's not done with his fight yet. Now he wants accountability and most of all the truth, which he says is still being covered up. From the White House, Jonathan Rodriguez 9 on your side. Step in